Welcome to Lightboard Learning, where we discuss coaching principles. Today, I want to discuss the strength continuum, but relative to aerobic sets. So usually, or in the past, you've probably heard us talk about the strength continuum and organizing contractions um, in terms of you know, when you should move from one to another or how you organize them inside of a training session. So today, I'm going to stick with the latter. We're going to talk about how to organize these inside of a training session, but I want you guys to think about how you organize them inside of an aerobic only day. So what I have laid out here is, 10, is three 10 minute AMRAPs. And inside of these AMRAPs, we have contractions. And I organize these contractions relative to the strength continuum in order. So you'll notice that for the first 10 minute AMRAP, the contraction that we're focusing on is five hang power cleans at a very, very light load. So we would consider this speed strength. If that load was heavier, we would say that is a strength speed activity, but because I put light there and it should just be boom, 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 that's speed strength relative to our principles. Moving to the second 10 minute AMRAP, you'll notice that the contraction that we're focusing on is five power cleans and two overheads at a moderate load. So think about maybe 60, 65, maybe even 70% of your clients one rep max. And now we're focusing on strength speed inside of this 10 minute AMRAP. And then the last 10 minute AMRAP, the contraction that we're focusing on is deadlifts, right? So we're doing five deadlifts and I put tougher here. So don't think about this being tougher relative to the percentage that we use for the power clean to overhead. Just think about it being tougher in absolute load. So if your client has a 400 pound deadlift, maybe you're, maybe you're going with 225 pounds here for five deadlifts in this sustainable setting. And this would be absolute strength. So mess around with this with your clients programming and try to organize contractions, not only in resistance training, but also in mixed MAP or mixed aerobic sessions as well.